Julian in the mountains is famous for its apples, but it's now facing tough times. Orchards ruined by bad weather. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Jesse Pagan. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. Marcella Lee has the night off. Tonight, there's an overriding sense of disappointment. A late freeze last spring, and then that powerful storm that ripped through the region did major harm. CBS 8's Steve Fiorina learned that many popular pick-your-own orchards have already closed their gates for the season. It's a September tradition. Drive out to Julian and pick apples. The opportunities are limited this year, though. Many orchards already closed for the season. Apple picking is still fun, where you can find an open orchard and reach high enough to pull down one or two. Most of the fruit, though, hit the ground. Bad weather, twice. We've been hurt. I think we probably did about a third the business we did in previous years. And Steve, it's a catastrophe for the town of Julian because it's not just me and the orchard there at uh, Vulcan Valley Apple Farm, but all of the apple orchards in the area experienced these 80 to 90 mile an hour winds and the and the four and a half inches of rain in one in one day. Of course, we love the rain, but not the wind because it put about half our crop on the ground. Slow going on Main Street and nearby. Lots of businesses that rely on a place like our 25 acre farm that just brings thousands of people up here every year. And when they don't come or we had to close, it really hurt a lot of businesses. Yes, you can still buy a slice of pie. You can still get apple pies. You can still get apple pies. Yeah, definitely. We have plenty of apple pies and, and all our other variety. Crowds are definitely down for now. Next on the calendar, Halloween and Thanksgiving. We're going to have thousands and thousands of pumpkins. We invite everybody to come up here. We didn't grow them this year because of the drought. Instead, we're bringing them in from Oregon and Idaho. As for the devastated apple crop, it does help to have a sense of humor. Our uh, motto, uh, very similar to some of the sports teams we know, is uh, wait till next year. There are still a few places you can pick, but call in advance. You need to make reservations. Steve Fiorina, CBS 8.